Hello, Earth Signs. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Tisa, and it's so great to have all of you here. I'm also known as Scent Star 555. We're here now looking into December the 14th and December the 15th of 2023. Everything, of course, that you need to know about me is all right down below in our description box. And thank you for your love and your support. Okay. So I'm going to to jump right on into this energy right here and see what we have going down right here. This is Earth, Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Let me put this down here more so you can see the table here. Okay. So Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. So I'm hearing, this I'm hearing for you, I'm hearing like the powers that be, okay? I feel like somebody that's high ranking in some way. I feel like something here has nothing to do with you. It has to do with the powers that be, okay? It has, it has to do with God, the universe, or the highest, most energy, the most highest energy, okay? Or something like that. I feel like, you know... Or it's not your rational mind where you start to rationalize things or something like that. It's, you know, it's your higher self, whatever way you want to call it. But something like that. I'm getting like, that's what's going down here. The most highest energy is, is present here in some way. Okay, what else is going on? Holy Spirit, Holy Angels is Earth signs right here. It's Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. What's going on here, please, for Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo? Okay, 2024. I hear get ready 2024 or something. Okay, what's the message right here, please? This earth signs. Taurus Capricorn and Virgo over here. The fashionable and the latest trends. Taurus Capricorn and Virgo, please. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels. Look at that 2023 and 2024. Interesting. Okay. What's the message right here, please? Okay, I'm hearing like some of you, you, you were building a house. Okay, and when I say building a house, I mean you're building it, not getting a builder to build it. Now, for some of you, maybe you are, but that's not what I'm seeing. I'm seeing somebody actually using like grout and con concrete. So I feel like that you're building a house or you could be building something in some type of way or doing some floors or something like that. I feel like you're cementing like these pipes or something like that. Okay, all right. Um, Let's see what else is going on here. Taurus, Capricorn, and Virgo. Okay. New addition right here. Puppies, farm life, birds, squirrels. Some of you could be moving. Could be the case right here. Yeah, I feel like 2020. Okay, that's what I'm getting right here. 2023, something will be completely different in 2024, I feel. Yeah, I feel like something here is completely different. Like, 2023, the energy of 2023, it's absolutely no, it's absolutely no match. I'm getting right here for 2024. It's pretty, it's no, it's no match at all. I'm getting right here, okay, to it, okay. And some of you, you will be traveling, I feel, soon right here. And this reading is supposed to be for December the 14th and the 15th. So I'm not sure if you're traveling now or this will be in 2024. But some of you definitely will be traveling, I feel. Okay, this feel like 2024. But, okay, but we do have 2023 years. So anyway, yeah, I'm getting like some of you right here, you will be traveling, I feel. Um, I feel like that you'll be seeing all different kinds of um animals, puppies and Farm life, okay. The squirrels and the kittens, they could be very different, I feel, for some of you right here, okay. Yeah, because I'm getting like, okay, this I'm getting here. In 2023, the fashion and latest trends was the puppies right here, the squirrels and the, and the birds. And I just feel like in 2024, it's going to be completely different. It'll be a different trend or something like that. And then, you know, then, okay, let's see what else I'm here. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, what do we have going down here right here for Earth, Earth signs? The source kept up on the back home. Yeah, I just feel like 2024 energy is so much different than this one. It's so much different, I feel. I just keep hearing, like, get ready, okay? Get ready. 2024 is going to be, like, whew, fire or something like that. Yeah, nine of cups right here. 
this is the wish card. Something here is going to be wish fulfillment, or it is wish fulfillment, I feel. I feel like that's the truth right here. Page of Swords is a, is a messenger that brings the truth right here. Something even could be about these windows. See how the window is at the top all the way to the floor. So I'm not sure if that's, what, that's the kind of house that you live in or you'll be living in or something like that. What's the message right here, please? Get ready for 2024. Yeah, it's time to contemplate about it, I feel, right here. For a source right here. Okay, and something here is the truth. Okay, like something here is wish fulfillment, I feel. Okay, it's coming, I feel. It will definitely be changing. You'll be traveling for some of you. You'll be traveling right here soon. Soon enough, I'm getting right here, okay? The tower. I feel like this tower is a revelation right now that you'll be traveling soon for people right here. If something here is definitely going to be changing in 2024, it's going to like really rock your world. I feel like in a good way. And now the cups your first card right here. Something's wish fulfillment I'm getting right here. It is definitely wish fulfillment here, I feel. So, let's get ready for that new energy or something like that. What else is going on here? Ten of Wands right here, reverse and a death. Yeah, something is goodbye to the old. I feel like you're putting some burden down. That's wish fulfillment to you in some way. Something here that was hard to do or something like here, or that was a challenge to do or something. I just feel like you're definitely going to be putting that type of burden right there down. Okay. Yeah, I just keep seeing something here about concrete blocks or something like that. I feel like you're building a house. Okay, yeah, the world card right here. Yeah. You know, they want you to contemplate about it. I'm getting right here. You know, how something here is going to change. Or it already changing right now. Or I feel like when we're in 2024, something will definitely be changing in some way. Okay. Yeah. Something could be changing about these animals or birds or whatever else. It could be changing about them, I feel. And that also could be significant to you in some way. Maybe you notice that they're changing in some way. Could be the case. Okay. Yeah, the moon cloud right here. So, yeah, I feel like if you was having fears about something, you're going to see, okay, that that's broken up or it's released. So fear, I'm getting right here. Yeah, so I feel like the fears will be leaving. If you was depressed, I feel like that's going to be leaving some people here. Some burden is being put down. That's your wish fulfillment in some way. Yeah, you're going to be really strong right here. I feel like your inner strength is really strong right here, I feel. Okay. Yeah, like a pentacles right here. Yes. Something here that you 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 want to do right here. You're gonna see it through. I'm getting right here. You're gonna see it all the way through. I'm getting right here some type of way. You would definitely see it through, I feel, in 2023 as we move into 2024. You're going to see something here all the way through. I feel like you're going to have the strength right here to see it through. It's going to be done. I'm getting right here for some people here. It's definitely going to be done. Okay. Yeah, for once. This could be about a house for some of you, or it could be right here um, a relationship. Some of you, you're putting some burden down right here about a house. You're putting that burden down. It's not going anywhere in this house. You know that. I feel like you're putting the burden down about a house. And then all this right here, you're putting um the burden down right here about a relationship. Or some type of project or whatever. Okay. So if it's not going to work for you, it's not going to work for you. You know that right now, Phil. Yeah, something could be wishful, wishful thinking about something that's going on right here. I feel like you're going to put some burden down about it right here. Okay, about a house or uh, about a relationship or a project. Okay. What's the death card right here in the page of swords? The death card right here and the page of swords. I feel like yeah, I'm this is what I'm definitely, definitely getting right here. Okay. When we leave 2023 and going to 2024, you're gonna see something here is definitely not the same. I'm getting like something that you wake up to is not the same. Look how you wake up like this. I feel like that's not the same. Okay, than what you was looking at in 2023. I'm like something here is changing in some way. Definitely it's, it's changing in some way. Something has transformed or changed right here. Yeah, seven of wands reverse. 
some some big challenge or mountain or something like that that was here in the way is moved or something I feel okay seven of wands reverse that's putting some burden down or some defense mechanism or something like that death is ending I feel okay yeah because that's your karma or something like that a justice is served in some way so justice is now served I'm getting right here for you okay I'm getting like from right now 2023 and going into 24. It's already served, I feel, right here. Yeah. This one is the Page of Wands is reverse, okay? See, I'm getting right here. If something here is not good news to you in 2023 and whatever kind of way it could be, it's going to be removed right now. Yeah, that's probably removed right now, okay? Because that's justice, okay? And that's fair or something like that. That that will be removed out of your life right now. It's going to be dead right here. Death card right here and a justice. It's time for something to end. If somebody passed away, justice is served for them in some way, okay? And please do understand that sometimes it's within the court, okay, that justice is served. And then other times, right, it's not always in the court that justice is served. But some type of way, justice is served, Right here for somebody that passed for some people here justice is served for them i feel okay as we move into 2024 you're going to see that i feel okay and for some of you that could have been maybe justice was already serviced away right karma has a funny way of showing up right and some of you with the seven of wands right here you couldn't see that karma was served for somebody here some way i feel like some mountain is moved you're going to see somebody has karma right here some people right here. Yeah, the world card and the four swords. Okay. You will contemplate about it for some people right here. Yeah. You will contemplate about something like that where you're going to see that, I feel. Okay. Some of you, you are going to start looking into your crystal balls. Okay. I get a sense right here. You're going to look into it and get the answer to something right here. I get a sense. Definitely. Okay. Put some message right here, please. The world and the um, four swords. Yeah, ten of cups. Yeah, you're about to be happy. Somebody's going to be happy, I feel, right here. Somebody's going to be happy right now. Okay. Yeah. I feel like it's a new beginning, happiness for your family or for you. Or I'm also getting like, you see this one? I'm getting like, you be setting the tables now. Or I don't know if you do catering or what. But I feel like something about the table is set right here. Or... Maybe you have a dining room table or anything else could be okay, but that's new energy that's also here in some way. About that, I'm getting yeah, king of swords right here. I'm even seeing right here that you see air signs, king of swords right here, in a whole different way. I feel like you see air signs in a different way, Aquarius, Libra, and Geminis. All right, this even could be them, it could go either way. Maybe the air signs see you in a different kind of way. Okay, communicates. But the King of Swords is definitely um um somebody that's very analytical, somebody here that is very intelligent. I feel like whatever you're seeing about the air sign, I feel for some of you right here, you could be happy about it. Ten of Cups right here. Some of you you're happy about it. Okay. Well, let's see what else. Eight of Cups right here. Now, some of you, I feel like you have a desire for something else in the world. You'll be able to move or do something else in some way. Some mountain, some stubborn mountain that was here, stopping your growth or stopping you from moving in some way. The world, the cycle's over. It's over now. You're going to get a beautiful new beginning right here. And some of your air sign does have something to do with something right here. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini maybe with the moon card here too. Okay, so I, I'm just here right here with the tower and the moon that for some of you, dreams do come true about something. You know, some of you might realize dreams really do come true about something. Okay. So that's right here, please. Yeah, I feel like for some of you, this is going to be a big old surprise to your swords. Something's going to happen here that you're not even going to see coming, I feel. Yeah, this even could be the way you were seeing something. It is definitely broken up, I feel, in some way. And you just see life or something in a different way. I feel. Could even be an air sign right here. 
It make, so that's a truth right here. I feel. That's a truth right here. I feel. Definitely. I just feel like something here is so surprising when it comes. The way the universe is going to do this is um, a big old surprise, I feel. It's like, you know, they're going to catch you off guard because I feel like that's the way they want this to be for some people here. Okay, I feel like something here comes in a thief. Yeah, it comes like a thief in the night. But the only thing is, it's good. It's good. I feel like it's really good. Something that's coming here is a thief in the night, I feel right here. Two of swords, you don't even see this coming. You don't. For some people here, you don't even see it coming, I feel. Okay. And that could be a good thing, right? To have a surprise that is enjoyable. I get a sense for some people right here. Yeah. I feel like that you are stuck right here in some way. And the universe decides here to blow the horn on some situation right here. Right here. So that you can experience something here in some way that you need to experience or there's time to experience now. Okay. So that's what I have here. Thank you so much for taking a look. And I send you all peace, blessings, of course, love and light. And I'm going to stay to you.